If you are interested in more slide design and content like this, I have two masterclass type of courses in PowerPoint. Why do I have two? Because one of them has one kind of design and the second has another kind of design because people who took the first course were asking me if I could, for example, expand my course by a completely different approach. I decided to make it a second iteration because I am updating both the first course and the second course. If you would like to... I can show you the examples that I have. On the left side, the first course teaches all those slides. Apart from that, I of course share some vector icons and then I expand the course with new slide design, which you can see on the left side. At the end, I share vector icons. Vector icons are really useful because we can click on format, shape fill, and we can change the color of the icon to any color we want. The same goes for the second masterclass. We have just different slide design here, but the concept of the course is very similar. We design slide after slide. I show you, I show you plenty of PowerPoint functions along the way. I also share cool resources, vector icons, and many more. Buying those courses gives you a new opportunity to learn PowerPoint and support me directly. Since you are taking this free class, you can click here on the bottom on the coupon and if you press here, continue, you will get a heavy discount for this course. I recommend that you just read what this course is about, check out the curriculum, which is available here down. You can check everything, what kind of lessons we have, uh, what do we teach here? What am I having here? I teach animation, I teach design, I teach a bit of kinetic typography, template creation, recording and exporting videos. So there is a really lot of things covered. Thank you very much for listening to this lesson. I do not want to hard promote the things to you. I just wanted to show you what do I have in my content in case you would like to learn more slide design and get more advanced in PowerPoint. This concludes this section. I hope we see each other in the next lectures.